Okay, here's what it looks like after I left the bleach in for about 20 minutes. Um, I just sectioned this off. I'm sorry guys, I forgot to film the part where I put applied the bleach and sectioned my hair off. I know, YouTube, new YouTuber struggles. But um, yeah, so basically I just sectioned it off and applied bleach to this section. And I use this Walla lightener. Uh, no, yeah. Okay, this Walla powder lightener. And I use the Clairol cream developer. I'm guessing it's red like this because I previously had my hair red about a year ago. I had it like a bright, bright red. I'll insert pictures if I can find it. And after I had the red and I got tired of the red and I started dyeing my hair black and I just all I had was just black hair dying you know kept dying it black 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 so I'm guessing the bleach what it did was lift the black and I guess under it you know was the red that I had previously I don't know I'm not a professional I'm just winging it <laughs> so and I, it looks like I got a little damage because it's a little looser but what I'm about to do now is use this Alpha G two-step treatment come on focus yeah but you probably you guys know what this is I'm about to use this and let's see if it helps uh, with this damaged I really don't want to cut it off okay this is what it looks like after I rinse the Afro G out and I blew blow dried my hair just a little bit. It's still kind of damp because I'm gonna be putting in this manic panic. Come on, manic panic in pillar box red. So stinks. Okay, but first I'm gonna be because I messed up right here. <laughs> bleach and I bleached I messed up right here and I want my roots right up in this area black so I'm gonna use the jazzing I'm gonna use that in ebony so I'm gonna use that on my roots so I'm gonna do that first I don't know if the well I guess the the alpha G kind of helps it's not all stringy in. So, hmm. Alright, anyway. I was like, it better work because the curls better pop back because I'm not cutting my hair again. By the way, y'all, I'm like uh, four years natural. But that's four years of just you know with no relaxer but this is this is not four years of hair growth because <laughs> I've cut my hair so many times I have shade I had a shaved side I had um what else did I do oh oh I bit chopped again after two years of being natural my hair was about this length after two years of being natural and I got bored and big chopped again. So I haven't cut my hair in about maybe about a year and a half. So in my New Year's resolution this year was to not cut my hair. So like I said, them curls better pop back because I'm not cutting my hair again. So I'm just applying this like that. Like I said, I'm not a professional y'all. so. I hope y'all subscribe and stay tuned for more videos because I'm constantly doing, um, constantly changing up my hairstyle. So I hope to film that for you guys, natural hair. I also wear wigs. <laughs> yep, I wear them too. 
I actually wear wigs more than my natural hair. I said I was going to start wearing my natural hair more, you know, more natural hairstyles. I was going to start doing that. Alright, here's the finished product. Came out pretty good. Like I said, I'm not a professional, so just did it the ghetto way. So it's like it's a little darker, I mean well lighter in there, and it I missed some spots here. So what I probably do next month, because I actually I want it lighter, about this color. I want all of it to be this color. You see how this is lighter than this part here. So what I probably do next month is um, use the highlighter with the developer. I try that again since what I think the last time when I tried to use it, the um, the developer using a developer by itself wasn't as strong it wasn't strong enough to lift the black so now that the black is lifted probably next month or probably a couple of weeks because i'm i'd be impatient probably in a couple of weeks i'll probably just um use the l'oreal so i can get it brighter brighter red Okay, so I'll come back and I'll show you guys how I styled it. Okay, guys, I'm back. Um, it's the next day. I'm on my way to church, so I'm trying to hurry up and take this down. So, I'll take this down. I'm in my kids' room because it's all gloomy. Usually, uh, I'll be filming in my room, but it's um, it's all gloomy and raining over here, so... The lighting is terrible in my room and they have um, a good light lamp or whatever. This camera has a flip screen, so the screen is up here. So that's how that's why I keep looking up here, and the mirror is over here. So forgive me. I'll get better at this stuff. I said, uh, I'll get better. I know I have a lot of flaws in this video, but I hope you guys enjoy it. I promise I'll get better. <laughs> okay. That's it. I gotta go. Gotta go to church. I hope you like it. I hope it was helpful. Mm. So, this is it.
I don't know, the back always seem like right up in this part. It's always shorter for some reason. I don't know why it grows slower. But this is the look. And all right.